so this should be the last recording session. It's very, oh, I, I know what it is. It was dead quick because this is all like this is oh, like an FMV. Where where are the subtitles? I'm not sure why it needs a recap. It's, it's not done like a, an episodic style. I'm telling you, Ellen has been asking for you. I don't. I just don't understand. Hayate, you mustn't act on emotion. What the hell was that anyway? It boom out of nowhere. Ah, this would be the explanation. What do you want with me? I just don't understand the part. This, this could this this could work as a trailer for the story mode. Not one bit. Ayane, it's up to you. I still don't get that. Why, why the fuck would you, would you entrust Ayane to do it? I'm looking for Alpha One Five Two. Whatever do you mean, Kasumi? Hayate, the world. This is pointless. Alpha One Five Two are still unknown. You shouldn't bear this burden alone. There's something I feel I have to finish. It's like you shouldn't have to bear this burden on your own, mate. And she's like, you just don't really do anything to help her out. That's not something any normal person could pull off. Doritek has no involvement. By the way, is that girl your messenger now? I need to find her and put an end to this. I really can't figure out what the point of putting this in here was. Was this? I'm most satisfied with the results of our test. Was this actually a was this actually a story mode trailer? Are they just decided to put in the game as a, as a cut scene? Because there's no logic to it. It makes no sense. I really don't get it. Ah, right, Bayman. So he's come back here then. I can't imagine who he'd fight here. Because, oh. Hayate. I'm following Kasumi. This is random. Oh. Perfect. Because there's something I want to ask of you. Okay. Let's you fight. Show me what it can do, will you? Why would I do that? Because you and I are searching for the exact same thing. And only one can find it. Okay, I thought what he was going for was. Alright, show me what your Moog intention style can do, Hayati. Then I will then I will know if it really was one of your ninjas who, who attacked me and my men and killed them. Damn it, stop hitting me. Damn it. Haha. -ha. Damn it. I was trying to knock him over that wall. That failed. Man, why here of all places? What a dumb. Why is Zach such a tool? Hey, I've been looking for you too. Elna says she's got something real important to talk to you about. Something that concerns world peace. It's kind of funny how high a tin knows, Bayman. He knows him by name. It's like. Bay man, I know you. And that's Zach's theme for the previous games. Because of course, Ryu has to be the cool guy. Dick. I'm sure you're a fight pilot. You just creep me out. Don't blame him. Zach's face is all fucked up in this one. I don't like I don't like this, this shitty jokey music. I mean, is this Zach's new theme or something? Or is it just like that that that, that, that circus stage? Take this, you fiend! Stop! Let's hit! Stop hitting me, man! You're supposed to stop and do nothing and let me defeat you. Damn it! Because of Bayman has, has these bullshit, these bullshit roll moves. There we go. That's how you do it. <laughs> oh, he's gonna kill me. No, you can't kill me after that. No. Yes. 
I'm not sure I can really you can your threats of to kill Zach really work after you threw him into a fucking chopper. Took him out. And bring her highness a message. Tell her I have other places to go. Sure thing. But that was rather silly. I'm about to hear a sound in the background. I think I think it's a helicopter going overhead. I'm not sure. The ninjas. Oh, I talk like that sometimes. I just do. She's angry. Why is she an ass, though? Hey, we need to up the level of surveillance. <sighs> okay, that was a sh short conversation. Could she not just press a button to do like some kind of intercom thing, or maybe she's talking to like Lisa? So I'm assuming I'm going to get to fight Christy now as the Bayman. That's probably what's going to happen. You can head back. I'm going for a nightcap. How shit is that guy's model? I don't think they updated the character models for the, this next gen version. They might have done. But I can't say for sure. But those civilians definitely didn't get any kind of update. And it's amazing how bad they look. Well, well. It looks like you got here first. <laughs> Why not just shoot her then? You have the opportunity. I don't... Oh, oh is this meant to be like Scoob? Yeah, it must be Scooby. He came in by water. But he's not wearing the flippers, which is good. Seems like you had a bit of a slip up. And I think that scar will be with you for life. Guess I'm all grown up now. What? <laughs> if you say so. I okay, what, what is this dialogue? This place, since you're here. Now I'm going to fight you. See, I think that's supposed to be a reference to um, when Chris and Eleanor fight in DOA 4. No, stop striking me, you bitch. When he said bingo, it's like he's saying gringo. Which is basically would be funny. See, I don't like doing that move because it just opens me up for an attack. Damn it! That's the thing, like, I, do, I, I think I'm supposed to press a button straight away after that counter. It's just... Now that shouldn't be his default counter for any move. So at least when Ryu's is supposed to be followed up on, it still gets the enemy away from him. Come on, you bitch. Don't kill me, you slag. So yeah, this, this is going to be my uh, last recording session of uh, DOA. I don't think it can be the last episode. Man, it, it depends on how many chapters are left. Or how long the last chapter goes, because that could be a long one. I'm not sure. I mean, DOA 4 last, lasted like 12 years, that fin that final chapter. <laughs> she exploded. I got a new title of Assassin. I got the Eleanor chapter. Uh, so we get a proper look at the timeline placement. It just moves back to um right back to the start of the story. A little before yeah, I think it's just around the same time Ayane has her first fight in the story. Well, that's silly. I'm going to have to fight Bass. Th that's random. President and CEO of Doha Tech. We're still not clear when about she took over. Because it didn't really come up until DOA 4, but I think she's a dimension she's supposed to have taken over in DOA 2. It's not clear. Uh, Donovan real Doha Tech from the Shadows, which is the company of the Project Alpha, blah, blah, blah. Eleanor destroyed it all. 
and she survived and she's making a new do attack and starts with DOA 5. I mean, I don't know why. It seems kind of pointless when you really think about it. I do like when the, when the background music is just like, like music from uh, different games. There's a term for that. I, I don't know if it's, if that, if it's diegetic or non-diegetic. I'm pretty sure that's, that's a term for it. It's so weird how everyone's just friends. Someone told me you were working out here. The foreman seems to think you're doing a pretty good job. Or oh, don't let me interrupt your game. How random. Oh. Hey, thanks. You're too kind. <laughs> this just seems pointless. You look like you're in shape. But I heard you retired. You don't look like he's that in shape. It looks kind of fat. He's basically built like the big show. The well, it's big show. And that's going to hit someone. Nope. Well, well. She caught it. I thought I'd found a quiet spot to be alone. How's it quiet if you're in a bar that's playing music and there's other people? But then two old friends had to show up. She don't even know Bass, does she? But then again, Bass knows Eleanor, so I guess it doesn't matter Bass, if the characters have actually fought each other. Quit. That's a shame. I thought a stud like you still had some fight left in him. This is dumb. And Christy. Why the like Eleanor's looking at her ass? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? I came on a search. Well, like, Eleanor's just You're looking at Chrissy's ass. Man. It's doing the eye thing. Wait, she's looking for a real man. So then Eleanor's going to fight her. Still, it's a nice outfit Eleanor's, bro Eleanor's rocking here. Come on, you slag. No, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me, you slag. Oh, like that cool kick move. No! Stop, stop hitting me, you slag. Ooh, she's defeated. How bad does that outfit look now? It's dirty. <laughs> it's basically how bad that gets when it's dirty, but yeah, she, she just beats the crap out of Christy and just leaves her. Why has she not killed her yet? I mean, she's shot people before, hasn't she? Yeah. Kokoro. It's good to see you again. Yeah, Kokoro still does not How know that she's Eleanor's half sister. You're living together in Tokyo, aren't you? Yes. But she told me she had to take a business trip out on a ship somewhere. I f Is that so? What the hell is that doing in the background? Well, as the head of Doatech Japan, she has a lot of responsibility. Doatech Japan. I don't know. It's like so. I'm, I'm assuming that these two are supposed to have like gotten closer during DOAX two. She never talks about her work. Because they had one fight in DOA four. So, Elena, I, uh, I wanted to know about your father. What kind of man was he? That's a good question. <laughs> he was a good father, a kind man. He wasn't. He, he, he was. He was hanging out with Rido. You know, the guy who raped someone. Sure like, you, you hang around with a rapist, but I guess he might not have known Rido was a rapist. Oh. But I still, it's like, so. you're kind of a dick you pile around with someone like that. I don't remember my father, and there's this woman who was just talking about her father, and my mum worked for her father, and I she knows who I am. I mean, it's not the most yeah, obvious connection, but still. Yeah, that was quick, wasn't it? She, she don't waste time, does she? I'm sure, I'm sure if I was pressing the buttons and it just weren't working. Stop blocking everything, you bitch! Yep. 
I'd, lo I'd actually love to see someone like, you know, basically trying to like, recreate all these fights from the story mode, but like real high level play. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Fuck. Damn it. I wish counting was easier in the game. Cause it's not fair when there's, when there's a mechanic that's like, that's like a major... Oh, I didn't know you could do that. A major part of the gameplay. It's like, you know, it's a major mechanic. So you'd, you'd think it would be a bit easier to pull off because it means that the uh, AI has, has a much easier time with it than the player does. I suppose you could argue, well, that's just part of the learning curve. You're supposed to try and get better, which is true, but there's just that many fucking inputs to it. I'm not saying it'd be easy to counter someone's attack that in real life, but it's like, in that case, it's, I don't know, I feel like, I feel like it'd be easy to uh, know what to do, know where to move your hands to in real life. Not, not saying it'd be easy to actually pull off, but it'd be easy to know where to go. Whereas here, it's difficult to know what button to press. And it's only attempt three. That tends to be how it goes, a lose twice and a win. Yeah, I think she kind of just killed the sister. <laughs> the next day. So, is she just hanging around here now? Eleanor? Oh, look, it's Lisa. You can tell because she's like the only black woman in the series. There's Miyako's face! Remember, we didn't see that at all in 4. So I, th I think Lisa's supposed to be working for Eleanor while also working for Donovan. So I'm going to have to fight Lisa now. That's a problem with these uh, story mode fights. Is like you have all these incomplete scenes. Like because you don't have a scene after the fight, you, the scene's just incomplete. Like like Kokoro then, a, a, Eleanor beats Kokoro and then, then what? Also, I'm sorry, but when you have Lisa wearing a fucking lab coat, it looks so idiotic for her to be using this fucking luchador style. You know? I mean, I know they didn't have that particular backstory. No, they did have that backstory planned out for her when they, when they did DOA 4. That was part of a backstory, so... Yeah, never mind. Fuck that. This is a stupid idea to have her be a luchador. Understand what? You know? Also, I don't think Eleanor should be like 23. Oh, but I think she's 25 now. No, no, she'd be 23, I think, in this one. Because I think she was 21 in the old games. I don't like Zack. Why does he have such a big role? I mean, I know Zack's annoying, but why is the high set to be so ignorant? Yeah, it's gonna look real good. That is, if they can finish everything up in time. <laughs> I hope you didn't bring us why are Ayane's eyes red and a, her purple? No, it's never explained. Man, are you kidding me? No, uh, of course not. It's actually, uh, well, Ellen has been talking about this thing called Mist. Hmm? Mist? Yeah, that's right. I said Mist. So, uh... <laughs> what a Actually, gimp. I don't know anything about it. <laughs> oh, jeez. If you're that clueless, just shut up. Oh, she does is moan, Christ. I know I've just been doing nothing but moan during this cutscene, but she does literally nothing but moan. She was like... Eh, 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 eh. She sounds exactly like that. <laughs> she's like, Kasumi is a traitor, even though she's eliminating a renegade. You know, doing the exact thing the ninjas are supposed to do to keep their secrets safe. And oh no, she's a traitor now. Fuck you guys. He probably just teleported. He does that. I will tell you everything I know. How does she contact them, by the way? Because as far as we know, the ninja village doesn't have mobile phones. Or well, phones in general. They don't have any way of contacting the outside. So what? Do they just have to send letters? Or is you like the exception? You just go around with a mobile, going, "Yeah, mate, I've got a phone. You guys hasn't." Floor number one five two, Alpha one five two. That was a bit redundant. Its combat capabilities had been honed to perfection. It was time to enter the next phase of implementation. What next phase? 
Phase four. Yeah, so they make a big deal out of Phase 4, who's not even in the story. Well, that's not Phase 4, that's Alpha. You see, Donovan's... No. Doatek's key profit partners were the militaries of the world's dominant nations. Profits? That's what this was all about? That's what they were using our clan for? Elena is Doatek now. And I'm sure she'll take responsibility. Remember, it was she who tried to destroy the company when she saw what Donovan had turned it into. Look at you, use that sound effects in every version of this scene, it's kind of funny. Maybe it's supposed to be the sound the button makes, but I don't know. It's, more, it's meant to be like a teardrop sound. But Donovan created a new organization called Mist. He was determined to continue Project Alpha. Is he just after money? Is that all it is? He just wants money? In fact, it's possible Mist existed for years inside Doetek without a formal name. Then why does it need a formal name at all? What else can you that makes it easy to keep it a secret if you don't give it a fucking name. As you can see, Doetek maintains independent resource production facilities all over the globe. At one of them in particular, there have been some strange comings and goings. Donovan's pet assassin, Chrissy. Miyako, head of Doetek Japan. And Lisa Hamilton. She was the one who I think the company's lost cause at this point if all the major players are, are working for Donovan. Also in contact with Mist. She is. We suspect that she knows everything about Mist. And the location of Alpha 152. Which is why I told Kasumi where she was in the first place. And Kasumi went to that facility? Yes, that's right. There's something hidden there, I know it. I can't appear to do anything unusual, but I've made arrangements to slip you in under the radar. You, Ayane, let's I don't go. get it. This whole thing is just dumb. So Lisa is working for Mist, and she shows up at a Doatech facility, even though Mist is its own thing. Like, I, I, I really don't follow any of this at all. It's really fucking dumb. <laughs>